back to this guy. Wait. Well, I have a... Okay. Just want to talk with that gal again. This is a very pretty, like... Oh, there she is. Hello. Hello, Amanda. Connor, I've been expecting you. Would you mind a little walk? <sighs> Good thing I brought this umbrella for you. That deviant seemed to be an intriguing case. Pity you didn't manage to capture it. Mm. Deviants are completely irrational, which makes it difficult to anticipate their behavior. But I should have been more effective. Did you manage to learn anything? I found its diary, but it was encrypted. It may take weeks to decipher. What else? The walls of the apartment were covered with drawings of labyrinths and other symbols. Like the other deviants, it seemed obsessed with RA9. Hmm. You came very close to capturing that deviant. How is your relationship with the lieutenant developing? He seems to find it difficult when a Connor is destroyed and replaced. I know humans have difficulty dealing with loss. Working with him will be a challenge if it happens again. We don't have much time. Deviancy continues to spread. It's only a matter of time before the media finds out about it. We need to stop this. Whatever it takes. I will solve this investigation, Amanda. I won't disappoint you. A new case just came in. Oh. Find Anderson and investigate it. Mm. Another case. So, don't die! That's that's what I learned from that. You have reached your destination. Thank you for traveling with Detroit, Texas. We look hmm. forward to seeing you again soon. Oh, Hank's my friend now. Uh, beer cans and stuff. Lieutenant Anderson. Ring the doorbell. Anybody home? Find a way inside. Oh no. Damn me. That 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 doorbell sucks. <coughs> There's a window here. L1. Must be his puppy dog. It's wagging his tail, it's moving. Oh shit. It is unconscious. Lieutenant Anderson. Mm. He 
Easy, Sumo. I'm your friend. <laughs> See? I know your name. I'm here to save your owner. <laughs> It's a good puppy. Check on Hank. Probably drunk. Yeah, look. <coughs> oh shit. That's not a good sign. Let's say one bullet remaining. He was playing. Sounds of trauma. He's playing Russian roulette. Lieutenant. <laughs> Wake up, Lieutenant. <laughs> ah, me, Connor. Dickhead. I'm going to sober you up for your own hey, sake. Hey! You have to warn you. Leave me alone, this may be fucking android. Get the fuck out of my house. I'm sorry, Lieutenant, but I need you. Thank you in advance for your cooperation. <laughs> Get the fuck out of here! <laughs> Sumo! Attack! <laughs> Good job. Attack! Attack, Fuck, Sumo. I think I'm going to be sick. Ah, oh, leave me alone, you asshole. I'm not going anywhere. What the hell are you doing? <coughs> oh, no. I don't want a bath. Thank you. Sorry, Lieutenant. It's for your own good. Oh, oh, turn it off! <laughs> what the fuck are you doing here? A homicide was reported 43 minutes ago. I couldn't find you at Jimmy's bar, so I came to see if you were at home. Tape your Jesus, window. I must be the only cop in the world that gets assaulted in his own house by his own fucking android. <sighs> Can't you just leave me alone? You seem to have personal issues. You should consult a professional who can help you. Beat it, you hear me? Get the hell out of here! <sighs> hmm. I understand. It probably wasn't interesting anyway. A man found dead in a sex club downtown. Guess they'll have to solve the case without us. <laughs> you know, probably wouldn't do me any harm to get some air. There's some clothes in the bedroom there. <sighs> I'll go get them. Oh, excuse me. I don't want to read these. I need to read these earlier. No. Oh. <laughs> it's kind of a big house. What do you want to wear? Whatever. Stripey, hippie, streaky. Let's do hippie. We're going to hippify this fucker. You'll learn not to say whatever. Can I be nosy? No, no I guess not. <coughs> He's puking. That's not good. Are you all right, Lieutenant? <coughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, wonderful. Just uh, give me five minutes, okay? Sure.
Oh, Jesus! Something like it was. Oh, read. Hey, let me read it. Oh, intimate partners. Awesome. It's the kind of Android I'd want. Cool. Wait, hold on. I bet you there's. Checking. No, maybe not. He likes fast food. What were you doing with the gun? Russian roulette. Wanted to see how long I could last. Must have collapsed before I found out. You were lucky. The next shot would have killed you. Damn it. Sorry about the window, Lieutenant. I really thought you'd been attacked. Of course, Cyberlife will pay for the damage. Yeah, trust me, I'll send my bill. Kind of a jazz fan? He likes music, that's obvious. Puppy! Pet, pet, pet. You're a good puppy. Okay, he's a sports guy it looks like. <clears throat> Soul Records, yeah. Good to know. Pink loves jazz. <coughs> be a good oh. dog, Sumo. I won't be long. Hey, he looks good in that outfit. Good boy. Cyberlife Warehouse. That's where they keep the spare parts and the blue blood. Follow me. Right. We're following her. It's not a fixed camera anymore, I just noticed that. I can live with that. Watch out. Oh. Now what do we do? 
I'll find another way. Processing. My turn. Lucas, climb up here. I'm up where? Where the hell are you going? Um. Where are you? Oh. No! Marcus, that way. I don't know what I'm doing. I have no idea what's going on. Cyber Ninja. Cyber Life Warehouses. We have everything we're looking for. First, we have to get rid of that drone. Leave it to me. Reconstruct. Here we go. Let's go this route. Too high. This way. That's what we're doing. Smash, 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 fuck it up! Good. You okay? Yeah, yeah, I'm fine. Good job, Marcus. Yeah, you know. Quick, open the other crates and fill your bags. Take as what much I as do. you can. Yo, which crate? Which crate? Which crate? There's something. Wait. Oh, right here. No. I'd like to fill my bag. Take all that blue blood. <laughs> Hi. You were trespassing on private property. Your presence constitutes a level two infraction. I will notify security. John! God damn machine! Where is it this time? John! I need your help. John! <laughs> Just my luck.
Let's finish up and get out of here. Try to find some blue blood. We still don't have enough. Get all the blue blood you can, man. Check the bigger crate. What, what bigger crate? Oh, that big crate. Okay. Let's see what this is about. <coughs> oh, shit. P700. Why aren't you like us? Don't you want to be free? Free them. You could join us. It's like an, a virus, almost, it, it seems. North like that. <clears throat> Josh like that. Everyone, everyone liked it. Take me with you. He's on their side. We can't trust him. He took a risk for us. We can't just leave him here. We can't bring them back with us. It's too dangerous. You're gonna not. You guys might not like me, but they come with us. I know where you can find more spare parts. What do you mean? The trucks. They're full of bio components. They run on autopilot, but they can be driven manually with a key. Oh. Where is this key? Down there, in the control station. There are two human guards. We'll have to get the key without being noticed. This is suicide, Marcus. Our bags are full. We got what we came for. Let's go before they catch us. This is a truck full of spare parts. There'd be enough for all of us. We can't pass this up. And if we get killed, our people will have nothing. We can't take that chance. It's too risky. I'm gonna have to agree with that. We're gonna leave. It's not worth the risk. We have what we need. We can go over the fence. It's the quickest way out. Okay, then. Let's go. I have a feeling that if we went that way, we'd be losing somebody. Components. There will be enough for everyone. We couldn't have done it without Marcus. I came to Jericho because here androids are free. Free to live in the dark, hoping that no one finds us. <laughs> free to die in silence, waiting for a change that's never going to come. But I don't want that freedom. And I'm not gonna beg for the right to smile, or love, or stand tall. I don't know about you, but there's something inside me that knows that I am more than what they say. Hmm. I am alive. And they're not gonna take that from me anymore. Johnny Five is alive! Our days of slavery are over. What humans don't want to hear, we will tell them. What they don't want to give, we take. Damn. We are people. Mm. We are alive. You're we a toaster. <laughs> are free. Yeah! 
Robot rights.